This is the 14 by 12 wood pavilion with aluminum roof sold exclusively at Costco. Being that we live in the Pacific Northwest where it drizzles the majority of the year, the aluminum roof was definitely the best choice for us. I've linked the step-by-step -step videos provided by Yardistry in my blog. You will need to refer to these videos as you read the instructions manual. You will get three large boxes. We opened them up and moved each piece to the backyard. Step one is to fill out the box form found in the instructions manual. This will come in handy if you have any missing or damaged parts. Steps two through four is the post assembly, which was so easy that even my kids got in on the fun. My husband and I had assembled everything up to this point with these. In steps 5 through 7, the upright post assembly will be completed. We did that with three people and that was pushing our luck, so definitely use four people in this step. Be aware that even after completing the gavel upright assembly, you might have to adjust it once the roof is installed. We encountered this problem. One of the inside gavels was curved, so my husband really had to put his weight on it to straighten it out before drilling it in. Therefore, to account for any curved pieces, Use your 90 degree square and level throughout all of the steps. Steps 8 and 9 is installing the roof panel frame to the aluminum roof. The instructions manual recommends hand tightening the roofing screws so that they sit snug and tight to the roofing material. We didn't hand tighten the screws and this might cause our pavilion to creak just a bit with heavy winds. So don't skip hand tightening those screws to the roofing material because you won't be able to tighten them afterwards. Steps 10 through 13 is completion of the roof installation. As you can see, you can get away with only three people to lift the roof into place, but we highly advise the use of four, especially when placing the roof panel frame on the gable upright assembly, as adjustments may be needed at this point. It took my husband and I a total of four days to complete as we only had one drill and we had our two little kids to take care of. With more help and more focus, I think we could have finished it in two. Good luck, and if you're interested, I also DIY some beautiful outdoor wooden sofas which I've linked below. If you buy this, I'd love to know how you style it. Connect with me via Instagram. Find easy renovating ideas, DIY projects, and budget-friendly decor at minimalistfarmstyle.com.